let's get back to exporting in Vector. So whenever you, you want to export your selection or your page in Vector, you need to click the export button over here. You can choose whether you want to export the selection or the whole page. So yeah, actually in Vector you can make a selection and then click the export button and while here is the whole page being exported, you can also export only the selection which will be exported as a particular separate file. So you can choose a format, PNG, JPEG or SVG. And then you can adjust the width and the height of um, your files that you want to export and simply click the download button, which will export the file di directly to your computer. You can also print the file by clicking the print button over here, which will connect to the printer that uh, you are connected to and let you print directly from Vector. You can share the file via the unique URL, which is located over here. You can copy it using the command C or simply click here. And then you can send it to your friends and whenever they will uh, paste it into the address bar, there will be um, the file visible directly in their browser together with uh, some of its properties, like the format, fast for tree, width and height. You can, you can also actually edit that unique URL by changing the format. Uh, for example, here was welcome SVG, we can write welcome PNG, and that will create a, an exactly same file, but in PNG format. And you can also create the JPEG, and here is a JPEG file. And then when you save it, it will be saved as a JPEG directly from your browser. So for example, you can send it to your friends and they can adjust the format themselves directly from the unique URL that you have given them. And another really cool function in Vector is that you can share the files to your Facebook or Twitter directly.